Hello again. It's a rainy day here in Toronto um, and I got to thinking about what we're all grateful for. I'm not fond of rain. Rain is one of those things I can tell people. I'm not one of those singing in the rain people. But I remember that rain and water gives life, is rejuvenating and we have a lot to be grateful for. And there is a saying by somebody which says, if all we do when we pray is say thank you, it will be enough. Gratitude is what's allows you to be a better person, to be a more cheerful person. And one of my habits is to keep what's called a gratitude journal. At the end of the day, I look at the five most important things that I am grateful for for the day. It doesn't have to be anything spectacular. It could be something simple like I was driving along and I saw this beautiful rainbow. I was walking and I saw this beautiful garden in this place. Uh, and whatever it is, or somebody opened the door for you and it was totally unexpected but something that actually uplifts you and causes you to be grateful. grateful. And when we are in the constant habit of gratitude, we actually end up being better people to be around. We end up being lighter in being. And I also consider one of the aspects of gratitude I'm very fond of is also celebrating. I'm not talking of big parties. That's okay too. But I'm talking when anything good happens to you, celebrate it. It is is giving thanks for the fact that whatever it is came into your life be it a card be it you know you pass those wonderful exams celebrate it that is a form of gratitude when you can't celebrate it you're not anchored into it and it doesn't allow similar things to happen you celebrate one success another one will come into your life so do consider celebration as a form of acknowledgement and saying thank you for having those wonderful things come into your life. So I am very fond of my gratitude journal. I've been keeping it for several years now and I feel much lighter. I pay more attention to the positive things in life. And because you're being grateful, and there's a lot for everybody to be grateful for, to, let's face it, um, you end up having much better interactions with yourself, which is always important, and your thoughts, as well as with other people. So in the meantime, Click below somewhere there and, you know, subscribe to the newsletter. Bye now.